Tonight, a local grandfather and army veteran says that he was attacked in Uptown Charlotte. He says a group of teenagers jumped him after an argument and left him bloodied and bruised in the middle of the street. Reporter Erica Jackson talked to him about the violent encounter. They put, the, put about five clamps in my head. Paul Withrow is grateful he can sit down to share what he experienced Tuesday night. He's grateful to be alive. He could have died right there on the spot while I was down in the street, bleeding from the head. The U.S. Army vet told CMPD he was attacked just before midnight on Dalton Avenue. With Rose says he doesn't know the three teens who left him with facial scratches, bruising, and five staples in his head. The one of them, the little short one, he gets off the bicycle and takes the seat off and comes and hit me. Hit me in the head with the bicycle seat. Withrow told police the teens got away with his bike and bags carrying his cell phone and keys. He's thankful officers found him in the street and took him to the hospital. He learned another set of officers tracked down his stolen bike. His other items are still missing. Material stuff that they took off from me. My bicycle, my keys to my car my telephones, everything I had in that little personal bag. This grandfather of four hopes detectives can track down his bags and track down the teens responsible for his physical and emotional pain. So I want them stopped. Well, if it, they'll do it to me, they'll do it to somebody else. Well, thinking about that veteran who served our country, uh, Withrow is still waiting to get his bike back from police. He says officers told him it's being processed as evidence. Now, anyone who might have information about this attack can submit an anonymous tip to Charlotte Mecklenburg Police.